Hi, I'm Matthew DeSero, and what I do is magic. But we're here with Hydrogenics, and what they do is for the real world. And it's mind blowing. We're in California today talking with a key hydrogenics customer of this technology, Stratos Fuel. A little bit of magic. Uh, it'll actually make my jack reverse itself. No way. Yeah, that's kind of cool. <laughs> we're Stratos Fuel. Um, we were founded in 2013 um, with the focus to exclusively um, produce renewable hydrogen. So we consider ourselves a renewable hydrogen infrastructure provider. So that pertains to the, the, you know, the production all the way down to the retail side of the gas. So what we're doing right now is we have built our first phase, which is um, the station build out. So right now we have one station, we're in development of three other stations, and so we should have a total of four by the end of 2018. So how the heck do you fuel these things anyway? Uh, the difference is that this is H70 and this is H35, and a uh, big truck would pri primarily use H35, Right. Um, and it takes about 15 minutes to fill. H70 does, fills your car about three to five minutes. So now our second step we are now taking wind and solar power, so renewable electricity, and we are channeling that into these proton exchange membrane electrolyzers, so PEM electrolyzers, and we are going to produce hydrogen using renewable electrons and water, and we're gonna distribute that to our station network as we build out. Basically, our model is to have production retail outlets, and we wanna basically replicate that and take it throughout the state of California and throughout the country. What's uh, Hydrogenics been like as a partner on this? Uh, they've been great. Um, became acquainted with uh, Hydrogenics in 2013. And from there, we uh, expressed our vision, uh, what we wanted to do for the industry. We wanted to have producing, produce the fuel, and we wanted to retail it. And um, Hydrogenics has uh, enabled us by providing us with the equipment, and supplying us with uh, the expertise, the engineering expertise, in order to do so. Red cards in your hand, black cards here if I snap. The uh, red cards will jump in chains, please. Uh, that's amazing. So what's uh, going on with the fuel cell industry here in the U.S.? There's a lot of work going on uh, from uh, government agencies uh, providing initiatives to move the technology forward. So especially here in California, right now we're working with, uh, with Daimler and also a new flyer to put the Celerity fuel cell power system into their, into their chassis. That's a truck and a bus. Both projects will be demonstrated in L.A. Like in 2018, 2019. So I got to hang out at a hydrogen fueling station. And the stations that you've visited, these are already open uh, stations. They're, they're fueling uh, vehicles, and uh, it's part of the, the plan to build a hydrogen infrastructure here in, uh, in California. It's not having to be transported over a great distance to the point of use. And uh, this is an asset that the owner uh, of a fleet uh, can actually control and manage and, and fuel their vehicles with clean uh, hydrogen technology coming from uh, our electrolysis portfolio. So can you tell me a little bit about the strength of hydrogenics in this market? So hydrogenics is, is well suited for the, uh, the heavy duty truck industry. Uh, our experience in system integration, our robust technology is the, uh, is the key to providing technology that, that works here. And we're here with uh, Daryl Wilson, CEO of Hydrogenics. When we're delivering applications for public transportation on buses and trains, we know that the most important thing to our customers is reliability and safety. And here on this product, we've worked very closely with a number of partners to figure out the way that we can do it in the simplest and best way possible to give the best result for the customer. So here in the Toronto area, we're building the, the first full public station where somebody can drive their car up, use their credit card, and fuel up their vehicle. So that's a very exciting breakthrough here. Other places like Korea, Japan, California, Germany have a target to have 100 stations. And so we're looking forward to the day when we get 100 stations in Canada also. This is one company that does it all. Fuel cells for transportation, critical power, electrolyzers for hydrogen generation, and storage. Hydrogenics, the name companies around the globe rely on for some of the most innovative solutions. That's just a start. Check out our other videos of Hydrogenics technology.